Our thoughts have a very powerful hold on the direction that our lives are likely to go in life, hence why we talk so often about the four agreements and not taking anything personally and not making assumptions because ultimately those things will either tarnish the way that our mind is working and functioning or it'll uplift it so that we can move on to the next thing. So when you reflect, what do you spend the majority of your time thinking about? Are you mostly thinking about the past and mistakes or are you thinking about trying to please other individuals' view for your future? Or are you spending your time reflecting on who you want to be and what actions you can take to make your future the best future that you could possibly have? Because I've noticed a lot of the time people spend their time thinking about the things that make them frustrated or the things that they can't control or the things that they don't have any power over in their lives. And then they just are completely wrapped up in this 24-7 and their conversation is bleak and it's as though they've been sucked into a black hole and that's all they can think and talk about. And if this is you, there's nothing wrong with that. It's merely a byproduct of... Um, habits and consistency in one realm instead of another, but I personally believe it's beneficial to our time to just let go of the things that we cannot control. I believe in the Bible it says something about having the wisdom to distinguish the difference between that which you can and cannot control and focusing on the things that you can control because then you actually feel like you have autonomy. And then maybe eventually you will have control over the things that you felt like you didn't have control over. So today I would just encourage you to Stop focusing on all those outworldly things that you cannot necessarily control, like whether or not they decide to vote on the infrastructure bill and then your stocks don't go because they decide to delay it again. That's something I can't control, so I'm not going to get frustrated about it, even though it costs me money. What are you going to do? Whatever it is in your life, just know that you can't control everything. You just can control how you respond to it. So that's me for today. Thanks for tuning in. Toodles.